Coronavirus is throwing a wrench in many people's holiday plans as the CDC asked folks to stay put this year as case numbers continue to rise. Our Baldwin County reporter Ashlyn Ayers hit the road to see how the pandemic is affecting one of the busiest travel days of the year. A lot of people still hitting the roads for Thanksgiving travel this morning, and many say while they did have to adjust their original plans like driving instead of flying or having a smaller family gathering, they are taking extra precautions, but happy to be able to see some family after being shut in for a while. After months of isolation, people are ready to celebrate Thanksgiving together. The pandemic is making that difficult this year. Some say seeing family is worth the risk. I'm actually excited about traveling and being able to go and do and um, enjoy our time with our family. While others are forced to make some tough decisions to keep themselves and those they love safe. And especially because my mom is sick. She has uh, high blood pressure, diabetic and all that. And uh, um, I had open heart surgery, so I had a triple bypass. So nobody can come over here and see us. If you do decide to hit the roads, the CDC says there are some other things you can do to lower the risk, like wearing a mask and limiting stops. I got gloves, I got uh, hand sanitizer, I mean everything, I got all the things. So I just pump and let's go and not even go buy nothing at the store. I got everything in the car. Alda is also having to take the wait and see approach as they're not sure how coronavirus will impact Thanksgiving travel here on the roadways, but they are hoping to take what they've learned over Thanksgiving and apply that for Christmas. Reporting in Loxley, Ashton Irons, Fox 10 News.